Доброго вечора. Ми з України. Всім привіт! З вами Гроша і це проходження третього Відьмака, а точніше другого доповнення Кров та Вино. А ми зараз побіжимо до княгині, поговоримо з нею. І на рахунок вчорашнього квеста, який ми проходили на стрімі, там реально можна було знайти карту, але це карта Брукса. А вона в мене вже була. І гра вирішила мені другу копію не давати. Не знаю, навіщо розробники так зробили, що саме Бруксу там можна було знайти. Тому що її можна виграти в основній частині. Може в цьому була якась задумочка така, невеличка. You arrived and trouble followed soon after. Ой, бля, як він мені не подобається. At last, Witcher. We've been on tenterhooks. Did you catch Milton's killer? Found the beast of Beauclair. Just couldn't kill it. We sent you after a monster and you return with nothing? We are very disappointed. Situation's not quite that simple. Beast's a powerful vampire. Ha! <laughs> Is this a problem? Is it too much for a witcher? A monster slayer? But everyone knows how to end a vampire. Draw him by trick Боже, to sunlight. Or arm yourself with ample garlic and drive a stake through its heart. Garlic's useless against vampires. Sun and stakes don't hurt him either. Those methods? Pure invention. Only work in legends and fables. And Buckthorn? When I was a child, Grandmama Ademarta always claimed Buckthorn drives off vampires. Silver sword's your best option for keeping them at bay. But it won't get the job done, because only a higher vampire can truly kill another of its kind. Excuses. Ha! <laughs> your Grace, I shall assemble a batu. Bring the matter to its end at once. The Witcher need but tell us where to find this monster. Бля, він реально на клоуна схожий. Бля, якщо б все так було про... просто, да? Чому ви тоді раніше, блядь, не вбили цього вампіра? Go ahead. Send them to their death. Certain death. To a lone witcher, perhaps. To 40 of my men at arms, but another skirmish. 40, 50, 100? Doesn't matter. Won't make any difference against him. You have not seen my guards men in action. Can they fight fog? Hit a target that moves faster than the wind? How? What creature can do such things? Creatures like this one. Higher vampires we call them. Each one's a little different, unique or exceptional you might say. Some transform into giant bats, others communicate with animals, command them. Yet all are still brainless beasts. Dead wrong. Thinking of lesser vampires. Alps, Ekimaras, Catacans, for instance. They're ruled by instinct, sure. Attack anything that smells of blood. Higher vampires? They think. They employ reason. Monsters driven by reason. A curious contention. What then do you intend to do? It's way beyond being some monster. This is a powerful being that's walked the world for centuries. Tja, impossible. If so great is their power, why have they not killed or enslaved us all? Don't usually meddle in our matters. Mostly stay out of our way because they don't care about humans one way or the other. And they do not fear we shall wipe them out one day. They're well aware of their strength. Then what can we do? Do you have a plan? Try to talk to him. That's our best bet. I cannot believe this. Her grace summons a witcher to kill a monster. Instead, he wishes to chat with it. <laughs> know what I'm doing. His lover was kidnapped. He's being blackmailed. Blackmailed? Be so kind as to explain how a vampire might be blackmailed. Higher vampires? 
They're like us, motivated by emotions, not instinct. Not only are they intelligent to an extreme, they're emotionally rich, capable of feeling many things, even love. This one fell in love with a woman, a human, and he'll do anything to keep her from harm. You do not, I trust, suggest we let Milton's killer go free, or wait until it murders again. We must render it harmless as quickly as possible. Which is why that's my aim now, to prevent further attacks. Vampires only half the problem. Blackmailers at fault chiefly. Kidnap the woman to control the vampire. And what do you propose to do? Yeah. Ничего, дивитися просто. I'll find the blackmailer, free the vampire's lover. You were to destroy him. Not help him. No one else should die. That's most important. As soon as the woman's safe, he'll have no more reason to kill. Hmm. I admit to being swayed, Witcher. You may be right. Do you know anything about the blackmailer? Got one lead. A few scraps of paper. Blackmailer wrote the names of the vampire's victims on them. One of them stained. A drop of wine, looks like. So damn little to go on. You've no idea how wrong you are, my dear. Send for the Ducal Sommelier. Hop, hop! In Tucson, wine is sacred. Here there is no such thing as a drop of wine or stains therefrom. They are stains from a drop of Estest, Erveluz, Fiorano. Your Grace wished to see me? Witcher, show him the paper scrap. Benoit, can you determine which wine made this stain? Mmm. Mmm, yes, yes. The, the west bank of the Sara Tour. That, that's rather obvious. Aged in barrels of Beauclair oak. Hue, deep burgundy. Clarity, high. Вот це геній, от це я розумію. The 1269 vintage. That's That's impossible. The wine is produced at Castel Revello, especially and exclusively for the ducal table. Perhaps some son real was stolen. We must go to the vineyard. See if there's not been an incident. Son Real. Never heard of it. It's highly unlikely you've ever had a chance to partake of it. As I said, it is only ever served to the Ducal family. Didn't stop it from ending up on that scrap of paper. Unless your grace's sommelier is mistaken. In matters of wine, Benoit is never mistaken. If he says it's Son Real, it is Son Real. We must ride to Castel Revello at once. Discover what has happened. Вона знову зі мною поїде. Grace wants to go with me. Out of the question. I hope you do not suppose we will sit on our ducal hiney and do nothing while our duchy is in grave danger. Your Grace, what you propose is far too dangerous. The Witcher should go alone. It pleases me to see you gentlemen finally agree on something. But I've made my decision. We shall go. Accompanied by the best possible escorts. You, Captain, no. and Geralt. Le. We will travel incognito. We've no wish to give the court any reason to gossip. For the duration of this mission, I release you from your obligation to adhere to court protocol. In short, from now on, I am Anna Henrietta, not your Grace. Yes, your Grace. Uh, Witcher, are you ready? No. В принципі, в принципі. А скоріш за все поїхали. Yeah, ready to go. Excellent. Ні, начебто нічого Give більше робити не потрібно. I must don something more appropriate and concealing. Then we will be off.
This vampire. Mm. Have you ever mm. faced its sword mm. before? I have. How did it end? Did you kill it? Didn't have to fight him. Hadn't killed anyone. Have you ever heard of anyone defeating such a vampire? Know of a man who defeated one, sure. But he didn't manage to kill it. Ultimately, only another vampire can kill a vampire. Что, все? Вы больше разговаривать не будете? Come on now. Ну там якийсь ще діалог. Panthers have attacked the wagon. We must help. Stay back, your grace. We shall see to this. Back you beast. Be gone. Ці пантери мене задовбали. То кам'яні ті пантери вчора. Ау. Так, зачекайте. Зачекайте. Це що, не звірі? Де плотва? Все, поїхали далі. Tell me more about this vineyard, Castel Rivello. It's the best in all Tucson. An old master of the winemaking trade runs it, Fabrizio. He trustworthy? He's held his post for years. There's never been a problem. Ну, я так зрозумів, почалось. The Sonreal stain. How did it wind up on the paper? Is someone from the vineyard blackmailing the vampire? Could be a servant. Could be the steward. Could be the wine was just stolen from the estate. We shall know when we arrive. It's not far now. Ми вже приїхали, я так зрозумів. Це ж воно. Ну так все. Це приїхали. Вони нам ті стомах. Оф, тресло. Captain de la Tour, we did not expect any visitors from the palace. How are affairs at court? Doubtless you've heard of the Beast of Beauclair. Well, we've our hands full. Especially since the rogue last attacked in the palace gardens. I trust her illustrious highness was not harmed. Kind of you to ask, Master Fabricio. I am well. Your... your grace? We were not warned. I shall order the salon prepared at once. That won't be necessary. As you can see, we are not here on an official visit. Naturally. Might I ask then what has brought you to Castel Ravello? Vino vipete. Came to see you. Got some questions. In this land, it is seen as polite to introduce oneself before asking any questions. This is Geralt of Rivia, a witcher. He has come to Toussaint on my personal invitation. Which is to say... Which is to say I expect you to treat him with the utmost respect. Of... of course, Your Grace. Did you hear that, witcher? Fabricio will be delighted to answer your every question. Want to talk about San Real? I am at your service. The San Real. How many vineyard workers have access to it? One might say only I do. Not like you make the wine all alone. At least a dozen others work here. I see you've little notion how wine is made. Grapes travel a long road before they become Sonreal. The workers assist me only to the stage of fermentation. I see to the maceration personally and let no one near the fat. Workers, again, assist me during barreling, but then I seal the aging barrels myself, each and every one. The wine lies in the cellar, gains character. 
Once this process is complete, it becomes Sonreal. And as it happens, only I have the key to the cellar in question. Ну поки що він винний, мені здається, але це якось просто. Тут щось не так. Who hauls the barrels to the palace? We've our own garrison. Guards who have served here for years and would answer with their heads for the wine. We'll not get anywhere asking questions, I see. It's a waste of time. Your Grace? How am I to understand this? Master Fabricio, we have proof someone's gained access to Sonreal. Someone who should not have, which means one of two things. Either you lie to our face, or you are an idiot who has had wine stolen from under his nose and not even realized it. <laughs> In either case, you shall answer for it. But... but... Silence! And listen. I shall inspect the barrels in person, thus giving you time to reflect. When I return, I expect to hear answers. Remind me, where is the Sonreal stored? In... in the main cellar, around the corner. I'll show you. I shall find it. Give me the key to the cellar and wait here. Oh, of course, Your Grace. Here it is. Come, Witcher. Нормально вона так на нього наїхала. Ну ходімо. We shall wait here, Master Fabricio. What if Fabricio так наїхала на нього, прям наїхала. He has his flaws, but I would never suspect him of such a thing. He's been very loyal. He owes all he has to me. His father frittered away the family fortune. He left his son an encyclopedic knowledge of wine. That is all. Fabricio lived as a beggar until I appointed him steward of Castel Ravello. Only then did he come into his own. Ну короче, вона вірить в те, що це не він. Але вино ж то в нього якось стирили. А ну якщо ти туди, я тоді сюди. І я тоді тут полазю. Що тут ще є? Трохи тут позичу. В них все одно багато їх. Все одно багато. Так, Анна Генріетта. Я йду. Ходімо. So where do we start? Let us see if all the barrels are present. Here's the inventory ledger. Не то. Це Ервлюс, да? Так. А що вона там дивиться? А, ось що цей списочок, да? Mm, Vintner's log. Fermentation completed with no complications. Tapped above sediment line. Here it is, barreling. Mm, everything lines up at first glance. Neatly and thoroughly documented. Then we must follow our other lead. Benoit said the stain came from the 1269 vintage. Let's find it. Ну, скоріш за все, я так зрозумів, ми його не знайдемо. Чи вона має на увазі інші бутилочки цього вона? То Ерголюс. То ми вже подивились. Це також на воно. Це також не воно, да, я так зрозумів? Да. Нам потрібно на другий поверх. І куди тут саме нам? 
Так, тут ось я оцю бачу. Ой, застряг трохи. Трохи застряг. Сан Грааль. Сан Реал. 1270 vintage. А воно не тут, да? Я думаю, воно все тут поряд. Та й опересите. Так, тут ми були. Це також Сан Грааль, да? Так зрозумів, да. Ну все, нам останні потрібно. Ну, дай пройти. Тут щось залутати не можна, да? Ну все, це наш вибір. Це також. Ну якась оця. Ліва чи права? Мені здається ліва. Вона якось боком так перевернута. Бля, вона повна. А, так вона там ще на всій постукала. Алло. І та, і та була повна. Що вона тут одну бочку постукала і все? Щось я не зрозумію. Оце я вже взяв. Кожну бочку так. Та ми так довго будемо ходити, так шукати, так пити буде і буде. Ще одна. Коротше, я їх всі проб'ю. А вона там нехай п'є. А чого, я не можу попробувати скуштувати це? О, знайшли. Револьтинг, бітер, плонк. Може б гонь сауру, як вінчі. Імпосібл. Це не вінь. Це є контаминаті рефюз, які ніколи не мали зробити в цю барел. Це факт, що він зробив, був не акцидент. Я впевнений. Ну це зрозуміло. Мастер Фабрісіо. Дивіться, що він має сказати про це. Master Fabrizio, I am very disappointed. But your grace, I... You are a step away from losing your head. Speak the truth and you might yet keep it. I, I, I admit it. I, I, I sold a barrel of Sorreal. I beg you to forgive me. Why did you do it? I couldn't resist. The sum they offered, it was enormous. I gave in. Is what I provide not enough? I wished to buy back my family's estate. For here, nothing is truly mine. I've a roof over my head, ample food to eat, but what is a nobleman without land of his own? I shall tell you everything, if you agree to show me mercy. Really thought nobody'd find out. I was a fool, very foolish. I beg you, Christ, you must forgive me. Who do you sell the wine to? A few weeks past at the pheasantry, a rich nobleman approached me. He called himself a diplomat, well-connected at court. He suggested we embark on an enterprise. 
some of his clients had offered dizzying sums for even a drop of Sonreal. He was to serve as intermediary. This man's name? He never revealed it. He was tall, black-haired, and spoke with a foreign lilt. He claimed to hail from Sintra. I've no Sintrin aristocrat at court. Wine itself. How'd you hand it over? We met under the cover of darkness in the ruins of Fort Astre. A dozen or so men came to collect. Armed men. The kind that stink of trouble. I had hauled the barrel there. They transferred it to their cart, and we went our separate ways. That's it? That the last you ever saw of them? They... that is to say, a, a few days passed. A, a messenger arrived. He said they wished to buy another barrel, and... Well, I've prepared it. Have it ready to deliver. No, you, you sure? That's enough. Know all we need to know. Your Grace, I beg your forgiveness. Get out of my sight. Captain, have your men take Master Fabrizio to the dungeon. He must answer for his crime. High treason the charge. What now, Witcher? We set a trap. Need to catch the wine thieves. Sintry and Noble could be our blackmailer. Next, transport. I'll take it to Fort Astra. Damien and his soldiers will cover me. For once, I agree with you. We will do as you say. Yeah, Let me know we? when you are ready. See no reason to wait. Let's get going. We will set out now. Position ourselves before you arrive. You take the cart and meet us there. Fine. When the handoff begins, watch for my signal. Який сигнал буде? Що мені потрібно буде зробити, якщо щось піде не так? Релакс, now we wait. Помедитуємо, помедитуємо. Бля, вони за, за однією бочкою вина такою толпою приїхали. <гум> ну майже, майже. Привіт. Ну от могли ж просто поговорити, правильно? Що вони почали? От розбійники. Кого мене бити, коли їх тут багато так? Зараз буде бум. Ау. Ау. Бочка гори? Гори. Так, давай вот так. Аксием с собой. Что ты теперь скажешь? Его долго бить будет. Давайте я вам, хлопцы, допоможу, то вы какие-то дуже-дуже повильные. 
Is it just me, or did we agree you'd wait for my signal? That was the plan, but... Great shot. Good thing you reacted. Can't say how that would have ended otherwise. At your service. It was a good fight. We managed to capture one of the scoundrels. Let's ask him a few questions. Come on. Witcher, a moment. I was wrong about you. Don't need to like each other. Just gotta do our jobs. If that's how you wish to treat it. At any rate, I see the effort you put forth. And I appreciate it. Let us go to her grace. She awaits nearby. Не, вот зараз він реально нормальний. Став. А до чого трендів на мене? Вона приїхала, реально? Wait, she here? I hope you did not think I would leave this to you alone, especially when every hour could prove essential. This prisoner of yours, bring him to me. We must ask him some questions. Captain, do the honors. Who sent you? His name is Dog. They say he plowed your mother. Oh, не той варіант вибрав. Once again, who sent you? Your nun's lover. They call him. І знову не той варіант вибрав. He doesn't wish to speak. He needn't. I can think of several other ways he can be helpful. I'm certain the Witcher will need bait to lure the beast of Beauclair. What? What? Fresh out. In that case, he's all yours. Captain, have your men find me a strong rope. Kind that won't snap when we hang this fellow from a tree. Rope? Live bait. Great for monsters, provided they catch the scent of its blood. But I'll see to that. What? No. Crikey, no! Don't let him! Stop screaming. Save your strength. Got a long night ahead of you. <laughs> no, don't let him! I I'll talk! What? Stretch us probably win Weber of Pravilny Variant. Barrels. Where were you gonna take them? I don't know. Captain, need that rope after all. <laughs> I truly don't know. Hornet's the leader, only he ever knew where to go. But he lies over there, dead. That one. The first barrel went to a warehouse at the port. But where this one was bound, I don't know. I, I speak true. You must believe me. Who hired you? He... he'll kill me. Ought to be worried about me right now. Who is he? Бля, його з'їсти можуть. А він таке каже. The Cintrian. That is what they call him. I've never seen him, but I know he mustered the man for this caper. That's what they said, that we were working for the Cintrian. I don't know anything else. I swear it. Take him away. Throw him in the dungeon. He shall await trial there. Captain, we ride to town. Gather your men and seek out the Cintrian. Someone else must have seen him, must know of him. Yes, Your Grace. I'll report to the palace as soon as I learn anything. I shan't return to the palace. Our mission has not yet ended. The Witcher and I will await you at the guard post near Let's go to town. It's late. Relax, he'll come. Що вона так маячить, Боже? How can you be so damned calm? Side effect of my mutations. We witchers rarely get the jitters. What if something has happened to him? Captain seems like a man who can take care of himself. 
Perhaps he can, but this Cynthrian appears to be no common bandit. He managed to steal ducal wine from under my guardsman's noses. We only learned of it through a fortunate coincidence. And it was he who specified the victims for the vampire. One must be exceptionally confident to blackmail such a monster. Still don't know this Cintrian's behind the kidnapping and blackmail. Might have just handled the theft of the wine. Even if it's so, he then sold the wine to the blackmailers. As I see it, that makes him an accomplice. Need to find the Cintrian, whether or not he's responsible for the murders. Even if none of it's his doing, he could still know our blackmailer's identity. Besides, it's one thing to know who ordered the killings. Other thing entirely and just as important is why they... Someone's coming. И кто це? Кто там? Бля. Captain, why so long? We expected you hours ago. This Cintrian does not work alone. We are fighting an organization, not one man. Bandits attacked us, not a small force either. One of my boys has a broken arm, another a shattered knee, lamed for life. And the word on the street is there's a hefty bounty on your head, Geralt. Oh, це круто. Used to it. Not the first time I've been hunted. Must you always? Now, the port warehouse where the wine was delivered, we identified it, then learned who had hired it out. This proved to be a beggar, a stand-in. We found him. He admitted all. A man had paid him to sign the lease, a man he met while begging outside the pheasantry. There, fate lent us a hand. A waitress recalled spilling wine on a nobleman who spoke with a Cintrian accent. What did he look like? Her description was not helpful. Handsome, well-dressed, with a beard. No distinguishing marks. This could be anyone. But she remembered his female companion very well, as she recognized her. On the Cintrian's arm was Cecilia Bellant. The singer? I've heard of her. She said to be gifted, fairy. The same. We went to her home immediately. Cecilia was not there, but we questioned her servants. A chambermaid claimed Cecilia is to meet a Cintrian gentleman tonight. She'd invited him to a reception mounted by the Mandragora. Це навряд чи коротше має якась правильно. A club, an affiliation of local artists, painters, sculptors, troubadours and dancers. Never heard of it. They exude mystique, consciously, I think, behaving like an exclusive cabal, artistic elites. Every now and again they mount soirees. Only wealthy patrons are invited. All arrive in elaborate masks, then drink and flirt. Gotta nab the Cintrian. Seems we have to go to that get-together. You read my mind, Witcher. I shall <laughs> gather my men, surround the establishment. Not a mouse will squeeze through. Бля. Out of the question. Не при... не if the Cintrian truly does have men about the city, he will find out and escape once again. Duchess is right. Need to be careful. Best go there, blend in with the crowd. Precisely what we shall do. We, Your Grace. Geralt and I. In that sort of company, the Witcher could use my help. Where's the event going to be held? The Mandragora always assembles at the same place. A residence in Oatville. It's a very distinguished district. Oh, Geralt, you must don't appropriate attire. Ну, бляш. Знаєте, що я зараз хочу зробити? Я хочу піти до Мільтона. Де він тут? О, ні, до Гільйома. Мільтон ж помер, да? Якщо я не помиляюсь. Давайте помедитуємо. І поговоримо з Гільйомом.
подивимось, що він нам скаже. Що таке? Ця анимація, начебто він меч в руці тримає. Отак, так краще, Геральт. Так, я можу тут десь по швидкому пройтись? А, в принципі, можу. Так, а я з тобою у гвінт можу зіграти, а ну? Так, ну підсергати мені, мене не потрібно. У, а він грає у гвінт. Давайте 50 монет, мені Wait, гроші потрібні. Мені потрібні гроші. На коробоб'янку. І ще на руни. Боже, мені стільки грошей потрібно. Де їх тільки брати? Ну, в принципі, в принципі. В принципі, в принципі, ми можемо все залишити. Немає відео, але є валах. З музичкою цього разу не пощастило якось. Там, я так розумію, у гвінт вони зробили в цьому доповненні декілька варіантів музички для саме гри. Якщо в основній частині, здається, там одна пісня грає у гвінті, коли граєш, то тут декілька. Оце фігово. Це дуже сильно. Там буде по 8, потім вони стануть по 16. 32 вже. Це фігово. Може в нього не буде мишвура чи гриба. А, ну хоча б мені пофіг, у мене жаба є. Я щось... Щось я це не помітив. Тоді нам взагалі пофіг. Ага. Навіть так, да? Ну гаразд. Гаразд, гаразд, гаразд. Тоді ми вампірів розігруємо. Щоб у нас була п'ятірка. Поки що жабу юзати не буду. Пізніше, якщо потрібно буде, то я заюзаю. І в мене, мені що ще сподобалось, в мене корова залишилась. Котра, якщо помирає, то призиває чорта з, з вісьміркою. Ну, гра вирішила, що, ну, крова не помре. Угу, ну це байдуже. Ми навіть зробимо зараз отак і повернемо його. І повернемо його. Я зараз не зрозумів, а це як так? Мені здавалось, що це одна копія, в грі одна тільки копія цієї карти. Чому тут дві? Що за прикол такий? Алло, алло, гра. Що, що тут відбувається? Гра, відьму, відьму мені таки не дали. Ні, це реально прикол якийсь. Чому в нього дві копії? Якщо хтось знає, то напишіть в коментарях, буде дуже цікаво. Я ніколи ще не зустрічав дві копії. Я можу спасувати, правильно? Давайте зробимо так, подивимося, що в нього ще там залишилось. Я тут все одно вже виграв. Якщо не в цьому раунді, то у наступному. Ні, все ж таки в цьому. Так, да, цікаво, цікаво. Так, а тут ще є корчма. А, це не з тобою. Мені от з тобою потрібно, да, поговорити? 
did you care so many of our sweet shining sun? Welcome, welcome. Be so. Тут нічого нового у них, чесно кажучи. Давайте ще раз у він зіграємо. О, потрібно було ви вибрати монетки. Тоб в мене там 25 стоїть, да? По дефолту. Ну гаразд, нічого. В принципі, в принципі. От сюди відьму. І взагалі все круто. Ну да, все, можна залишити. Юнтера немає тільки, да? Любий сток, любий сток, значить так, да? От так ти, значить, ти робиш. В мене немає любиска, але в мене є ріг. Да, це не так уж і добре. Шкода, в мене семірки немає, котра вбиває ближній бій. Оце шкода. Що, ми викидаємо всі карти чи ні? В мене просто ріг є. В нього любий сток, в мене ріг. І я все одно буду сильніший. Давайте поки що так зробимо. Я відео поки що не хочу розігрувати. Тоді ми робимо... Ой, отак. Тоді я зроблю так. <гум> Гівно яке. Якщо у нього є семірка, він зараз їх всіх вб'є. Або в нього немає семірки. І він нікого не вб'є. Давайте так. Ну, в принципі, в принципі. Схоже на те, що я виграв. Схоже на те, що я виграв. Що в нього може залишитись? Йорвен? Ще якась, може, легендарка. І відродження, мені здається. А ні, семірочка в нього є. А чому він тоді на минулий хід не зав'язав? Щось гра не те робить. А, треба, мол... треба мабуть, було все ж таки катапульту ту відроджувати. Так. Давайте зараз катапульту відродимо. Ну, в принципі, в принципі. Катапульта нам і не знадобилась. Так, ходімо. Ходімо, ходімо далі. Все ж таки, давайте завітаємо, да? До Гільйома. То ми прийшли до нього. З цим я у Гвін все одно вже грав. Завітаємо, подивимося, що там він і як. Бля. Чорт таке. Твій вунд. Відчуваєш краще? It's healing splendidly, though I am to avoid trouble for some time. To be frank, that is precisely why I wish to speak with you. Want me to stand in for you? Take on some trouble on your behalf? That could very well be the case. You see, there is a maiden, nay, a lady. I suspect someone's cast an ill spell upon her. A curse, perhaps. Let me guess. She suddenly grew cold, haughty and distant. Though the night before she was flirtatious and alluring. Tut tut, Witcher. You jest, yet the matter is grave. Though true, the lady in question is dear to my heart. I shall not deny it. I fear she has fallen victim to ill magic and knows no one she could turn to for help. 
What makes you think she might be cursed? You must keep all I say to yourself, I beg you. I would never dare to be so indiscreet normally, yet I'm troubled about her, for her. Vivian shuns the company of others. Though the fairest maid at court, she keeps men at a distance. I thus determined I would resort to trickery. Trickery? That even befitting of a knight? In war, yes. And what is love if not battle? As it were, one evening I crouched in hiding outside her seamstress's home. As Vivian emerged from it, I too emerged, ever so gently but convincingly collided with her, then promptly offered to escort her home. She consented. At first, all augured well. I proposed a more scenic route. She agreed. I made kindly forays into conversation, and she even began to respond as we neared the end of our route. Then suddenly... Then suddenly, mid-speech, from her mouth there flew a most hideous shriek. I stopped stone cold in my tracks while she turned red, then promptly ran off. I did not give chase, that time. I attempted to approach her on several ensuing occasions, to learn what had happened, for I feared she had become entangled in some trouble. I noted that often, come night, she ventures into the woods, where I've seen her walk about a glade near a pool. I've striven on occasion to follow her, but lost track each time. It seemed then she'd melted into the air. Sound you heard. She might have just had a sore throat. Had I thought it possible the sound was natural, I never would have taken up your precious time. Notice any other strange behavior? Additional symptoms? No, Vivian's avoided me wholly since the first encounter. But folk gossip. What about? They say she's secretive, that no one ever sees her after dusk. That she's wont to suddenly disappear. Nothing unusual about any of that. Tell me more about Vivian. Who is she? What's her story? She's her enlightened highness's lady in waiting. Her mother was a lady in waiting, her father a knight. That is all I've learnt, for the Duquesa grows angry when asked about her. Vivian spends her days within the palace walls. Yet we are in luck, for she has been named a tourney's patroness this year. Thus, each participant will be granted an audience with her. Got a problem then. See, I'm not a participant. I've devised a solution already. You should take my place in the lists and thus gain the chance to speak to her. Oh. I was looking forward to winning the tourney, very much so. Yet for Vivian, I am prepared to sacrifice anything. This tourney, how's it work exactly? It is the year's grandest and most important contest. Knights from all corners come to face off for the grand prize, and more importantly, for glory. A demanding test of knightly prowess in horsemanship, marksmanship and fencing. I qualified for the first time, had great hopes of winning. Yet... Yeah, I get it. Anything for Vivian. I should not put her your regular job, this. Not often I gotta take part in a tourney to fulfill a contract. Fee can't be anything ordinary either. I'm no magnet to command heaps of coin, but naturally I shall award you a just amount. How much do you demand? Зараз подивимося, мені цікаво, скільки тут цього можна взяти, да? 500, давайте десь 550. Ну так, щоб просто накинуть собі 50 монет. Agreed. That is an amount I can indeed muster. Fine, I'll look into it. Gotta admit, piqued my curiosity. I shall be forever in your debt. Now, we must ensure you are not eliminated from the tourney before you can meet Vivian. Meaning? Could you show me how you shoot, ride and fight, perchance? And you must learn the tourney rules, know how to apply them in practice. I, I did not mean to suggest I doubt your abilities. Everyone must train, even a witcher. Besides, the tourney contests must surely differ, require skills you don't usually apply, races above all. The choice is yours. Where shall we start? Бля, ти прямо зараз хочеш, да, це робити? Marksmanship. 
feel I need to do some shooting. Come with me. А, ну в принципе вот так можно, да? The marksmanship contest shall pit you against another for the best time and score. He who hits all his targets first wins. I, I just just Sometimes when you speak, I miss the meaning entirely. В принципе, це все потрібно зробити, спробувати. Підготуватись таким чином до турніру, але це вже буде, може, у наступній серії, а може, трохи пізніше. А з вами був Агароша, тож до зустрічі і мирного неба над головою. Слава Україні!